car finance are us.com specialist in car finance if you're struggling to get finance this is the company to go to if you're not struggling to get finance but you want a good competitive rate go to car finance are us.com whatever vehicle you've got your eye on that motor that you've wanted for a hot minute this is it you're one step away car finance are us.com Winners talking. Yeah, back in again. Come on. Another week, another Winners Talking podcast. Yeah, yeah. It's big PS, big Doug, man mm. them in the room. As we do. It's another one. You lot are looking for the manscape start, but we're not gonna drop that. We're gonna come, we're gonna switch you up. Oh, we're mm-hmm. gonna switch you up. We'll get to them later on during mm-hmm. the thing, innit? Uh, mm-hmm. You don't already know what it is with that. Um straight into us this week. We're back. Last week was a pre recorded thing, so some things didn't get talked to that we might have spoken before. Mm-hmm. I know so I see people saying they were coming, they wanted to hear us talk about AJ, they wanted to talk, uh, yeah. talk about a lot of things. And that can kind of work as well because obviously it's the, it's the Wilder Fury fight this weekend. Yeah. So, you know, man, them are sports analysts as well Come as everything on. else. So we're going to cover all of that. Because we'll man, them can talk, the man, them can critique the thing and talk the thing because we've got people with know-how in the room. We've got boxers in the room. You understand? We've got fitness trainers, we've got fitness trainers in the room. We've got boxing coaches in the room. We got football coaches in the room. Mm-hmm. You understand? We got it's a it's a it's a mixed bag in here today. Mm-hmm. So we got aficionados for all occasions. Let me move my phone out of here. That's unprofessional. Let me get that to the side. Mm-hmm. But anyway, what are we saying, bro? You good? I'm here, bro. Come on, family in the man. room. The team's strong. It's love. Shout out to all, all the viewers, all the supporters. Yeah, it's man. It's love. We're here. Big P, Big Dougie, Doug. All the new subscribers. The new subscribers. All the new. Big up yourselves, big up for man. Yourselves. I know. Um, a, a lot might have just come for the first time to get to know about the podcast. Yeah. It's not too late to go back and watch some of the episodes. Whole leap they're, they're, whole leap of the content. archive, there's whole yeah. heap of content and we're here for you every Sunday without Phil. Mm-hmm. You ain't got to, you know, we throw up the dough. We ain't asking you not for nothing but just for a subscription. It ain't a cash app. It ain't a donation. Mm-hmm. It's none of that. Just, it's just, just hit the subscribe, just hit the subscribe like. button and we're here for you. We're here for you as much as we're here for ourselves. Mm-hmm. It's a great thing. Winners Talking Podcast. The number one. Come on. The one and only. You're done though. Often imitated but never replicated. Trust me. Mm-hmm. Shout out my guy T in the room. You know for me comes mm-hmm. in tracksuits, it's winter. T only wears shorts all year yeah, round. Yeah, but he's in the I told him. <laughs> I, it's officially winter. It's, it's, it's officially, officially winter, winter. Because up to a couple of weeks ago I said, T, how long did I say you had? Two weeks. I said two more weeks in them fucking shorts, blood. <laughs> <laughs> Two more weeks in them shorts, fam. Man came out a big restaurant, yeah? Yeah. The whole gang's in there eating. Mm-hmm. 15 man's eating in the restaurant. Yeah. Everyone's dressed. Tea comes out. <laughs> shorts. This is 11 o'clock at night. Like he come from gym. Shorts. You understand? T-shirt. That came from a fresh 5K. He, I think he was good. He was good. <laughs> tough mother. He just, but salute he on that. Tough mother. Salute on that. Yeah, he did the tough mother. That's not a joke. It's no know. joke. Yeah, it's no joke. He did the tough mother. Yeah. Representing the gang. Come on, fully. that's not so a joke. The tough big up, mother big up for that because I, I respect it. All jokes are sad. I respect it, man. That's what we do. We mm-hmm. push, we move. Um, what's been going on in current affairs? What's been going on with you, Big Doug? I've spoken for a piece. What's going on? Talk Probably out here, you know, just there doing the thing with working as we always do. Do you know what I mean? You know, what else is, what's been popping? Like, oh, when and did something for FIFA yesterday. Yeah. Shout yeah, out FIFA. Telling. Yeah, but that was Essie Duns and that. So when and did that. Shout out Marnie for that. Um, yeah, man, just out here. We went and did the other thing the other day with Koldra and them, man. Shout out them boys there. Yeah, you know yeah, what I mean? Shout out them out. Yeah, man. And just, we moving. Move Everything's been people. popping off. Movie. Gigs episode had everything. The numbers great up. Episode. Great Shout episode. Great episode. Shout yeah, out man. Up. You know, so we're just we're just riding that wave off of the back of that. Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? And just doing what needs to be done. Back in the gym. You know what I'm saying? I see that. I see that. Yeah, just, you know, you've got the shorts on today. Yeah, I got the shorts on today. <laughs> I got the shorts on football socks popping nah, off you, you, You're a football man, so yeah. you can run it. Cause you yeah. just come from, tra- you've got yeah. some little trainings going little on. Trainings and, and little training, drills. So and you're used to the yeah, back boxing what's, as well. What's your excuse for your shorts, mate? What, well, my shorts? I yeah. went You went gym? No more. Would you put in that real work, though? Yeah, blood. I want a step machine. Yeah, okay. that's real. See what I'm saying? That's what goes in the room. Real, yeah. Dedicated discipline. Come on, discipline. Back boxing as well. Back boxing. Come on, so we're just doing our thing. We're just doing our damn thing. Shout out. Who else can shout? Shout out Posty. Mm-hmm. I spoke to Posty still. We had a yeah. back before we spoke. And 
between me and him, we had a little chat. He told mm-hmm. me that, you know, because I because I, I tapped a couple times lightly, like mm-hmm. it might have been taken as I tapped lightly when I said little that. Light yeah, because of the uh, the um <clears throat> the interview format with the NFTR. Mm-hmm. And I said about the gigs interview, that's what inspired me and mm-hmm. And I said that maybe they didn't ask the question they should have. And he said, on a level, he just said, you know, I was a bit, you know, mm. I was just like, listen, no harm, no foul. Yeah, yeah. You have to give posties props in it. Oh, and I told him this. Like, that's why I'm saying it, because I'm not one of them guys that will say something behind the scenes and then, and not, then say not say it. Yeah, so yeah, we're yeah. on a level where he said, he, he's like, you know, I thought you was a bit harsh. Mm-hmm. I can say on a level that I said to him, I said, if you feel that, my bad, innit? It's mm-hmm. Sometimes the way I express things can come across a certain way. Man but... say things on a... It, but we said that man say things on a real... Yeah. On a real level. Don't, it's, not, it's not washed out. Yeah, yeah, it's not washed out. But yeah. what I'll say is this. The same thing I said to him, I'll say now. He's a... No one can question that that man's a huge part of what everyone's doing yeah, and how culture. everyone's and what he's done for the culture and how mm-hmm. everyone's a lot of people's even with myself he's played a part yeah you can't question what grm daily shout to my guy pierre as well every time yeah you understand yeah. shout to pierre every time foundation you can't question what them men have done mm-hmm. for the scene and what them men still do and what them men represent for mm-hmm. the scene and so i big so i said that to us and i big you up every time mm-hmm. you understand I'm not on tearing no, none of these men down. If you don't cross me, mm-hmm. why would they? You understand? Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. all I want to do is big up the man them. I'm thankful to be part of what's going on now. It's a, yeah. it's a great scene movie right now. Like that. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Come on, yeah. it's a great scene movie great, right yeah. now. Coming on, bro. Yeah, so we're, we're just happy to be thankful to be part of it. So now, big up them man there every time. Mm-hmm. Shout out Posty. And out of that, we move into this. I want to know, set things rolling. Who's still going to be bumping R. Kelly? Are we bumping him or is he cancelled? I want man them say it with their chest. I see man them start shaking heads, sniggering. Some man's don't <laughs> talk it. I want to say it with the chest. I be Go on, I, you know me, I always say it say off. Say, toot, toot, beep, beep. I, and I'm going to be toot, toot, beep, beep. Mm-hmm. Was never in my playlist. What's in your playlist? Never like, was. never. I, bro, I'll be honest with you. I'm not really an R&B I'm man. Keeping it true. I'm keeping it true. I'm not really an R&B. Anyone knows me if no, you roll with me in the whip. Like huh? What you said? Man said, man said, he, what, what, so you can pull up two snaps. He said, there's a couple snaps of you listening to R&B. Yeah, R&B. but you would never be up. Uh, uh, oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, you're listening cool. to R. Kelly, see? No, I weren't listening to R. There's Kelly. Receipts. <laughs> there's receipts. Uh, there's the receipts. Man better bring out the receipts. Man better bring them up now. All right. <laughs> so you're saying you was never listening to it. Oh, no, so but, but I'm not saying this because now what's happened to him. What's happened to him has happened to him because of this is the way the industry, the man was working their thing. Mm. It all comes to the light in the end of the day. Mm. The, you know what I mean? If people are going to judge his, like now judge his music based off of what his actions, then you're just uh, a sheep. Like he makes sick music, innit? Like he's always produced dope music. Do you know what I mean? Throughout the time. But... I'm not really an R&B man, so it wasn't really my thing. Like, the Trapped in the Closet cool. wasn't really what I was listening to. Do you get what I mean? I was more of them eras. I was listening to Biggie and Total and, you know, them kind of, you know what I'm saying? Trapped in the Closet was a little after them Biggie, but I see what you did there. Oh, uh, yeah. yeah, yeah I see what you, did. You, made sure, you made sure that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But Trapped in the Closet seemed like, am I lying? Was Trapped in the Closet a lot later, though? Was it later? It's like 10 years later, but I see was what you did there. Oh, was it? Oh, okay, no, well, yeah, yeah. 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 yeah you were just clear. We're yeah, not, just clear. Yeah, just clearly. I weren't listening to no R. <laughs> All right, saying but, that. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you're good, you're good, you're good. Nikos, let's be real. Oh, well, I knew it. Come on, no one champions art more than Nikos, you know? That's Nikos' his artist, you know? <laughs> Is. Not anymore, clearly. <laughs> Back in the day, I used to listen to him. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but he ain't come out with no current hits like that for me. What was the like, what what era are you talking when you say back in the day? <laughs> come on, I want some. Well, I'll take it. What? Over ten years ago, isn't it? Ten years, yeah. You sure? What was you? Well, yeah, I believe I can fly like... times. <laughs> <laughs> Is that what you're talking? That, that that you can fly. No, I'm just that saying. Time no, but I... You get me? I'm just. Well, you're gonna make me choke on these high balls, but. <laughs> But I'm saying, no matter, no matter, thinking like this, it's techie. You know I mean? yeah, yeah. No, no, it's techie, but I, I don't listen to him no more. So you're saying he's cancelled? Yeah, because he ain't in my playlist like that. Is he cancelled because of his actions say... or because he's not in your playlist no more? A bit of both. Right. A bit of both. Doug? I don't want to jump on the bandwagon. I honestly, from what I know, I know he was always on a young thing when he was with Aaliyah and all of that. Yeah, but mm-hmm. the whole chart. <laughs> <laughs> But the whole charge, the yeah, whole right. charge is what he's getting charged with. I don't know the full charges, in it. I don't. I, they just said it bad. Yeah, it just I don't know that they were. Right. This is what everyone's been waiting to hear. The perspective, most important perspective. The room wants to know. Palms, what we say? Yeah, man, I'm not gonna still jump it. Still, like, mm. nah, listen, <laughs> let the man. No, the man speaking. Let him speak. Go ahead, palms. Cutting tree, yeah, and it's a couple extra or whatever. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you're, you're, turning, it, it you're, you're turning it off, blood. You're turning it up you're instead, blood. 
But what turning up? What cheese, pub? No, that's what I want to know. What cheese are men turning up? Chocolate factory and... He knows the time. Because it's the Sony kills now, you know. I don't know about Chocolate Factory, bro. I don't... What song's on Chocolate Factory? I don't know. That's... Brad, I don't know what... I'm going to have to say this because... What song's on Chocolate Factory? Bro, before Look at my putting his hands up. Bro! Before you say it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. This is it, I'm not denying that. Pass me a champagne, dub it. Which one? Rose? Yeah, Rose. Let's go, Rose. Go on, carry on. Can I say it? Because yeah, I'm sure I rang you and it weren't no fucking 10 years ago, bro. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to say. Like, it weren't no, you know what I'm talking like. about. Yeah, that was big. So what am I going to say? You called us to update him about the podcast. No, no, no. He, he... <laughs> <laughs> Tell him what time we needed to be here this yeah, week. Yeah, 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 I rang you. Go on. And what was happening? I was getting a haircut or something, couldn't it? Yeah, carry on. And, mm-hmm. and you heard a bit of that in the background. What it, song weren't was that, it weren't that one. What it weren't that one. Yeah, what song them times? Fuck it, I can't remember. Bro, I'm talking about that. You was like, oh. Man's watching the Kells. I can't remember what Kells concert you had on. Bloody, like, like this. Oh, the concert, the concert. <laughs> man was like, I don't know what's going on. Kells is the man, blood. No, 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 that's exaggeration, Ruben. That's like, that's like, ten years ago. Oh my, it worked no ten years ago, fam. Matt, go on, Pom. It is like even like the other day, I was with someone, and like, obviously I was in a car. Like there was an R and B session there, yeah, and like. And they put in R. Kelly. I was like, I looked at them like, raw. And I was like, you know what happened, right? And they're like, yeah, but still, man, it's a good song, isn't it? So what song was it? Like, was the one with um, Cassidy, innit? it? That nigga's got the black. He made it. He made it. That's a banger. That's a so banger. The whole time he's been denied. Come to my hotel. Imagine you're gonna tell me you're on holiday and heard that tune. No, no, the songs. This is what I'm trying to say. People have to be real. Like, is he like them songs there? Like, it's a banging tune, yeah. You that if there, bro, you still bump it. Like, if it was in Best the. Best of both worlds, slowly. I listen to I'm not bumping it. Like, after a minute, you're full bad in it. You're full bad after listening to it for a minute. Nah, no, Doug, say what you're going to say. Go on. Like, man, I'll be honest, people's craftsmanship in their work, we have to separate from what they do in a, in a sly way in their nightlife. Like, because, no, no, listen, no, no, because, no, no, because, no, no, because no, no, we was all. I'm in the hotel. In the hotel. That hotel tune, I forgot about that. See, when it comes to the music, I forget like something like that tune. When you actually said it, it's actually a banger. Like I know if we was in a club before all it, like he got, let's say like a year ago before he's been sentenced, where he's still and it come in. So I'm most of these little, you know yeah, what yeah, I mean, yeah, like yeah, a little, no, 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 a little no, shoulder. No, no, like, no, no, we can't now just meet like go on like his no, music super listen. dead now no, just no, because he's guilty no, of a crime. Now though, if that got played in a club now, are you gonna dance it? What if what got if man's the waved? Club? He ain't thinking about. I'm not waved. I'm not thinking. Oh, I can't dance to this because my man. I'm gonna look like some, I'm some fucking. You know what I'm Sipping saying? Like love and them things. Yeah. Yeah. What, 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 what tune was that? Let me step in the name of love. They're deep ones. No, no, no. I don't step to them ones. Let me get the call. You see, Doug. And I don't step to them name and love tune. That was deep. That's never my thing. Yeah, that's a deep one. Yeah, that's a deep one. That's deep. Man talking the boy. Well, no, yeah, yeah, yeah. For that to be a man's memory bank. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> You gotta lock it off. I'm saying you now. Nah, you're saying look at what you saying, bro. Off. And he was my favorite artist. We said, experience. bro. Say it with your chest, man. You can't listen to him without thinking. No, no, yeah, it's yeah, yeah. fuckery. Yeah. But I'm gonna tell you the truth. I'll be listening. Yeah. I'm gonna tell you the truth. From my personal opinion, mm-hmm. I'm a big fan of some of that nigga's music. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. He's got hits. Mm-hmm. Best of both worlds. Some of them chocolate factory dreads, whatever. Like I fucks with R and B at times and. He's got hits, undeniable, like huge. Mm-hmm. But in my mind state, he has to be cancelled mm-hmm. because you got to look outside of it. I've looked outside a bit. I can't, if he's kept up all of them things there, mm-hmm. like with them young girls underage and man knows in their mind, like take it outside of the fact of the fame and fortune. That's somebody's niece, somebody's daughter, yeah. somebody, you understand what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, so yeah, that's yeah, why yeah. I think he made like, imagine, it's all good for the whole world to be saying, yeah, but da da da. It's cool, but then the victims, there is trauma. Like yeah, they're fam- yeah. like there's tra- there's victims involved that just get overlooked. Mm-hmm. I know what you're saying in your absent mind. I'm not gonna lie. If in my absent mind, the Kelly uh, R Kelly tune comes on right now for a minute, I might not just be like involved. You understand? Yeah, yeah. Because they're un- they're they're bangers, blood. It'll come like boondocks yeah, yeah, in there if yeah. you drop a certain. Like, I know what you're saying. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The way you, when you break it down, like, like like I get it. Like, I just try to separate the crime from the I, music. I hear what you're you get saying. What I'm saying. I, I hear what you're saying. Yeah, I, I hear mean. what you're saying. Because on the flip side, people could be like, well, when the man them are rapping, mm-hmm. like this one's a drug dealer, that one yeah, shot five yeah, man, yeah, yeah, this yeah. one's done this, that, the other. Mm-hmm, yeah. So why is it cool? Because he's- We roll with them man and we would never roll with a nonce. We would never, and that, that's you it, just that's said that's it. The truth, the, the truth is, yeah. we ain't rolling with, out with no nonces. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. You understand? We ain't rolling with no sex offenders. Mm-hmm. If, we, if we knew there's a sex offender over there, 
chasing him. We're chasing him at the end. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, you know how it goes. He's getting, yeah, he's, come on. So, so we're not going to bump his... A sex offender couldn't release a mixtape right now, but I hear you. The man's got undeniable <laughs> bangers. Shut down. Mm-hmm. Shut down. I like, Lock off. Lock off. Mm-hmm. Come on, Daps. You know no, I'm like, I was the biggest RKD fan. Okay. But once all them stories come out, well, you got yeah, you can't, you can't listen you to the music in the same yeah. light. And you got to lock it off, man. Uh, you so all them CDs, if they said, right, they're vintage now, yeah? Would you sell them? Would you still sell them off or not? I see these when before. Why would you sell them? Why would you sell them? Man's going to collect the peas, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. What's my meant to do? Burn them? <laughs> no, if man's saying, if man's, say, if man's saying that you could, what, you wouldn't sell them on? If you, someone says, when you say the bag, what do you mean? If someone said the vintage, and how much? A couple bags. Yeah, you sell then you sell them, innit? Mm-hmm. You sell them, innit? Keep it moving. Oh, what are you trying to say? That selling it is like selling some your 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 your. Put, or putting it out there more in it, but it's like, is what it is, isn't it? Have Spotify and that removed his music yet? Probably, I don't know. I think that's coming. I haven't tapped in. Have you, have you, yeah, they've done it before. Did uh, they? I knew Nicholas. Well, you say you were searching, you could have yeah, found that's it. That's not that's what I did. I found it. I found it. I found it. Hey. Nah, blood, nah, I did it. 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 Nicholas is actually, but Nicholas was the the way Nicholas was going on about this concert, blood. Nah, nah. Why don't you keep it real? Nicholas was going on like it was the greatest thing you could see, blood. Man's like, nah, you gotta see it. Yeah, ten years ago. Yeah, 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 can you say that 10 years? <laughs> ten, that's that's time, before, time before you got niche, you know, mm-hmm, like, mm-hmm, before mm-hmm. there was any case. Mm-hmm. I saw a clip t- where he said something like, I don't even know if it's true. But, but this is like, the mad thing about it, though. This is the thing, and this is why society's fucked up, because I feel like throughout the whole lifetime of R. Kelly's career, everyone always knew what he was. Mm-hmm. And it's yeah, like, we turned a blind eye yeah, to it. Yeah, we we all turned a blind eye to it. Still turned up. No, we, I didn't know. I didn't know. No, but let's now come on. From Leo. From Leo. I remember hearing him whisper. Then there was all the other thing where he pissed on the chicken. There was a lot of whispers, yeah. There was a lot of whispers that kind of highlighted my man's activity. Wrong, and then it's not till man catch a case and he's convicted, everyone's like, okay, all of a sudden, yeah. uh, you know what, fuck our kills, fuck our kills. Do you know what it is? I think it's because think we, a... we try to protect one of our own until yeah. we, because we think everyone's at, yeah, at that's and true. a lot of the time they are out to get us. Yeah. So when it's one of our icons, yeah. come on, bro. Like, like I was when a youth man, like when and my mum had R. Kelly albums, bro. It's like, you understand? And then yeah. we grew up and then, I remember I grew up and then I went Nikos's and he had the 12 play album on record. On oh, well, vinyl. Mm. On vinyl. I like? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, the Nicky don't want to say it. Yeah, yeah. No, no, yeah. I did, I did. He, did, he, did. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he had the 12 play, you know, and so we grew up on this man's tunes. Uh-huh. So we're going to defend him, but when we hear conviction and guilty, mm-hmm. you know, I think we just kind of have to kind of. That's where we draw the line. You've got to draw the line. Yeah. But some people. Rex, what are you saying on R. Kelly? You bumping him? Yeah, he cancelled. It's cancelled, yeah? Mm. Say less, say less. Go on, T. So, God forbid, say if you don't make it in jail and someone duppies him, kills him, yeah? Mm. Is he going to be like a classic like Michael Jackson? And he's going to be like, you know? Great you question. Know? Yeah, that's a good question. If he does what, do you feel like? That when he comes out, everyone's going. Everyone's going. Coming out. Man can't. Nah. He ain't coming out by the yeah, sound. Yeah, no one ain't going. Even at a concert, people go. But still. you then know what? Go. People yeah. always. Nah, but then again, yeah. fans love our killing. People still bump him. People bump him. And big gal bump him. That's the maddest thing. But this is the thing. Big gal bump. This is the mad thing. Big gal like say they're turning them off. I don't know. It's a tough one because. It's like it's people, because like, no, you know society, everyone want, want to sit down and make out like they're perfect. You know? no, no, like, everyone's like, definitely. oh, you know what, R. Kelly. But then, like you said, he'll come out and there's mostly a group of fan of girls that, regardless of the crimes man's committed, they'll go and live in his yard. They'll go and live in his yard same way. He, like, could, say, <laughs> he, could, put, so, he could do a TV show yeah. and say, I want eight gal to come live in my house with me. Yeah. And and the audi- forget the eight, the auditions will be round the block, yeah, yeah, yeah. up the road, yeah, 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 around yeah, yeah, the corner. Yeah, yeah. mm. Because I feel like in society, I feel especially in the industry, especially in America, like we, we don't get all the information, but like just like anywhere has an underbelly and an underworld, yeah. Like mm. I feel like it was mostly common knowledge that that's what he was into. Mm. Do you get me? Same way like when we was growing up in, in the UK and all them eight the people they used to have on TV. Like all them nonces and that, they, it was common knowledge, but people turned a blind eye to it. To it comes to the, them, to come, them, what was that brother's name? Jimmy Savile. The what was the other one that played the didgeridoo? The, um, Rolf Harris. Rolf, Rolf Harris. Harris. All Rolf of them. Yeah. Rolf Harris. Gary Glitter. Yeah, bro. Oh, you know, bro. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, this is what I'm saying. Why don't you draw the pictures and blow up? That's what you're saying. You were saying that. I saw a little picture where Arkell was saying that he's going to bring down a bag of people. A bag of people. He said he's going to bring down a bag of people. Like if he goes down, he's been Yeah, nah, that brother, that thing is. No, 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 that's not. No, he got still even. They're going to kill him in jail. He's ready to throw everyone under the bus. 
Right. He's both only got footage in his yard of man that come to his parties and did the holy for bad. The real chocolate factory. Some niggas, niggas, he go get whacked in jail, man. We chopped that. We chopped that enough. I think everyone said their opinion. We move on. One sec, one sec, one sec. I need your attention just for a moment. Listen, did you not know that you can go university even if you don't have GCSEs or A levels? You can go two days a week, study, and get support from the government between 9,000 to 17,000 a year. You don't have to have GCSEs or A levels, I repeat. Yeah? Go to ukplatinumservices.com. Use the referral code POUNDS, P O U N D S. And they'll pattern it all up for you. Let's get some more bods in uni. Yeah, just because they tell you, oh, you didn't pass your GCSE, you didn't get A-levels, da, da, da. No, you can still go and study. Two days a week, you can be there studying. You can be studying fashion, media, music, business, social care, so many courses. Let's get to it. UKPlatinumServices.com. Use the referral pounds to get everything fast-tracked. Get you that VIP treatment. Pounds, P-O-U-N-D-S as the referral. UKPlatinumServices.com. Um, boxing this weekend, mm. Wilder versus Fury. Do you want to cover that first or talk the little bit, piece of AJ first? Can we, we can go AJ and then Wilder? We can go AJ first, then we'll yeah. go Wilder. Because we didn't get to cover it, because like I said, last week was a pre-record. So yeah. let's talk AJ. Mm-hmm. You know whose opinion I want to hear most? I want to hear Daps' opinion on the AJ thing. Go on, Daps. The man said he wants to hear your opinion uh, most. Talk the team. Yeah. Wait, in the room I said I wouldn't have chose that fight for him. Mm-hmm. We agreed. But mm-hmm. when he spoke and said that I tried to box him and did it, the coaching's all left. The coaching's gone left. And I don't think he's really got the heart to really want to get licked down because his bank account is fluffy. So really and truly, do you really want to put yourself on the line when you don't really have to put yourself on the line? And that's what it felt like when he was watching it, when I was watching it. So you felt like in there, he didn't want to take the risk. He didn't want to take the risk. He didn't want to take it. Mm-hmm. And the it, risk of getting knocked out. The risk of getting knocked out. And I think he could have knocked him out, but you have to risk getting knocked out as well. And mm-hmm. that's what the, the risk you want Yeah, yeah, definitely. Taking taking a punch, to, 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 to knock man. Yeah, exactly. That's the risk yeah. you didn't want to really take. But, mm. you know, we go again. You know how the thing goes. He wins the rematch, though. Does he? I think he does. He has to change a lot. It's a conversation. Yeah. He has to change a lot. If he comes back in one... And I've said my yeah because even when opinion. I see the picture at the end of the fight because I didn't really watch the build up and I, when I was in Leeds I didn't get to watch the fight I only see little bits and pieces yeah but he looked like he was he lost bare weight like it's like he trimmed up like the he, coach has got him on a different diet style. like a different so it's like he tried to come in to box the the cruiserweight because what well, my man was a cruiserweight before isn't it shouldn't have been boxing him, yeah yeah he shouldn't have been boxing him and two he should have just come in heavy and just bullied him mm. do you get what I'm saying mm. straight out on the weight on the ropes. Just weighed him in. Aggressive, man. aggressive, man. That original AJ. Yeah. Because yeah. what it is, I think, <clears throat> Palms, I'll let you speak in a minute because you're the boxing guy. I think that where he took the L to Andy Ruiz, mm. it gave the opening for that coach to really get in his ear. Because yeah. you listen most after an L, innit? Yeah, yeah. So where that coach has got in his ear and been like, listen, you got to get on your boxing, AJ. Like, all of this stuff you do normally, we're going to switch it up. You're just going to box. You're going to move. You're going to box. You're going to move, which is what he did in the rematch. Yeah. Now, obviously, where it's worked, and then it's worked again. Who did he fight after Ruiz again? He Pulev, fought. Pulev, Pulev. Pulev kind of did the same, but with a knockout, back, with a finish. Like, he's got on a boxing thing where the original AJ was on an aggression. It's more, I, I say it's a safety first boxing thing. Yeah. Like, his safety. He's not really stepping in on them jabs and sitting on them. Yeah. Like, it's more flicking it, flicking it, looking for an opening move. But you can't do that with someone that's lighter than you, yeah. faster than you. Yeah. And let's be real, a better technical boxer mm-hmm. than, than you are. You'd be you'd, Original AJ, Stiff original jabs. AJ. Stiff jabs, hard. Killer AJ. Yeah. He's... he's, he's He's beating that brother. Yeah. He's, he's sticking it on him, mm-hmm. hitting him, and the ruthlessness is gonna. Did he come even up. really throw an uppercut? Did he throw it? Because you know he's got only with the, only with a hand on the back of the head. He tried to throw a few like holds, oh, pull his head know. down, but nothing much that's was his, going on. U six too slick with it. Really, he's a very Usyk slick guy. Said, Wait, he felt AJ when he did touch him. I know he touched him. So that's mm-hmm. why he, he touched him, but he didn't follow him. through on it because. Once you go in, you're putting yourself at risk and in mm. danger. And I don't think getting rocked in the third round was it the third. Yeah, he got yeah, rocked, yeah, and I don't yeah. think that helped because that obviously puts a doubt. Like he knows he can, he can he touch. Can you, you, he can yeah, hurt. yeah, yeah. What are you saying, Palms? I feel like from the knockout with uh, Ruiz, I think he just mm. he's lost all his confidence, man. Mm. He, like it's gonna take a while for it to to, to, um, to come back in it. So I don't feel like he's gonna win 
if he, I think he should not even fight. Um, um, what's it? Well, good, maybe two or three fights. Yeah, but his confidence is gone, man. But then the belts might be gone though. But you see, what it is he needs his confidence to get back. You get knocked out, yeah. Even if you get dropped, like your confidence goes, because like yeah. you're like shit. How did I get dropped or knocked out, isn't it? So I feel like nah. He knows he's got a vulnerability. Yeah, like, yeah, we all yeah. knew that he had some vulnerability because he's mm. human, isn't he? But now he's seen. He's he's. Mm. To me, it's like when he gets holds that bang like in round three, it's mm. like he's thinking, "Oh shit, it's happening again." You know the ones like yeah, that's yeah, the yeah, oh yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah. You understand? Like, yeah. and he did well this time though because he he wrapped him up mm. quick, didn't let nothing much more go on. Yeah, that's, yeah. That, that's more experience. Mm. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm trying to say, but it's taking a little piece away from that animal yeah, where yeah, it's just yeah. like mm. I'm just gonna lick you down because but. Spiteful fucker, you know, when he was on, yeah, he I remember was he said, on, yeah. on that. To put his tongue out after he Yeah, he had the, the vicious streak, but, yeah, but my yeah. man's reeling him in, reeling him in, yeah. reeling him in. No, AJ, yeah. box AJ. Stick, yeah, stick to your jab, AJ. Yeah. Stick to your jab, stick to your jab. Yeah. He's not letting him off the leash. On And now there's a little bit of hesitancy. I don't know, man. Rematch, I don't know. I don't know. If, it, if it's the same style and pattern, yeah, it's gonna then it's going to be the same result. I feel like he don't come out like He's got to come out. The, what are you saying? I don't, like, out I don't feel he comes out and does stone heavier. He comes back a stone heavier. He comes back in. He's gonna kill up. Kill and, and I like one thing with AJ. He's he's got pride in it. Yeah. Like he's very he's got pride and respecting himself. Where mm-hmm. he don't want to get mugged. So he's gonna come back looking mm-hmm. to lick up man's man. head. Yeah, and I'm gonna come back looking to lick before and it all in it. Like I feel Go on, like, tell me the few, like yeah. I said, like I said before, like I think that. Like, I don't know, business-wise, it makes sense to lose this fight. You've taken the L before. Like, you ain't got to protect the O anymore. Mm. Do you get what I'm saying? Like, so you can afford to take this L. It gives you a two-fight thing. Them man are doing their trilogy, quadruple, who knows, fifth fight, whatever them man are doing mm. over there. So you know that ain't going to come anytime soon. And then who, it's like, uh, you fight Usyk, who else is there that you fight? Do you go back to Dylan White again? Do you get what I'm saying? Where do you, mm. so you can afford to make, like two paydays out of this fight, you lose the first one comfortably because he didn't really get dropped like or nothing. It's an easy loss. You come back. He nearly got the yeah. last round. It got sticky. <laughs> yeah, the last round. I saw the, the last round. It did get sticky. sticky. I saw. I saw clips of the last round. But then you lose this one. You come back in. Like you say, you come back in heavier. You knock my man out in the fifth or the sixth or the seventh and have it. And then it just I think three times like that, champion. Laughing. You get me? It runs like that. Then, happy you know day. what I mean? You, then you get another payout, sell out another arena. I don't know. Like I just feel like, there's, I feel like boxing nowadays, it's also boxing and there is the realness amongst the fighters. But then also, I think also with the likes of Eddie Hearn in your corner, he's a he's a businessman. He's clever. He knows what he's doing. So you're saying it? that he lost on purpose, Doug? Boy, I don't say he lost on purpose. But I don't feel like AJ loses a fight to my man. Like, honestly, um, I don't... He does, bro. <sighs> oh, you mean the rematch or this one? You can't see how he lost this one? This one, I don't see how he lost this one. You don't. You got to know about Usyk. Yeah, no, you got to know about Usyk. Usyk is a mad You got about but... Usyk. Yeah, he's a mad... Because got... I, I watched him in the Bellew fight. Yeah? Yeah. Like, he's proper, but I just feel like... You've got... AJ, like, for the amount of fights he's had and the level he's at, yeah, and what he should be, like... You go in there, you go in there, and you thump this brother up. Regardless of how good a boxer he is... Like you're you're six foot something mad. You got mad reach on him. You you work the jab from a distance and you fist this brother up. This brother can't come in there and be dancing around you and punching you up. I no. get where you're coming from. No, cause, but because I mean, I'm like, saying the, if you mean original AJ, would you? Yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. I feel like you come in like the, the AJ that man that the man that man grown to love and mm. who man supports. And you come mm. in and you fist this you out and you get him out in the eighth or something. Do you get what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, and he, and I feel like original AJ. And he's had a lot of hard fights. So I don't know why all these fights are just becoming like they're becoming. Tougher and tougher, and I think it's because he's trying to it's box. It's a style change. It's a style change. So you're you're now brick making these fights closer than they should really be. Do you get what I'm but saying? Definitely, it weren't no fi- it weren't no fixed fight. No, nah, no, nah, it weren't a fixed it's fight. Just, but I'm just looking at it. I'm playing devil's advocate, looking no, at it from you. both sides of the coin, innit? It's, I feel you, Pans. What, what are you saying though? Rematch? You're saying you shouldn't even fight him in a rematch? Nah, get two more fights. Two more fights. fights. Get confidence back up. I just think he's confident, man. Like, like he doesn't look confident, like. He's even throwing a jab too much. I, it's not like he's not on like worse in levels, but it's like his confidence ain't there, man. You can I, see. I think what AJ lacked in boxing ability originally, he he had in animal and yeah, like yeah, yeah. Mm, like that aggression. You understand? Yeah. But now he's he's getting more into the boxing boxing realm of it. It's catching up with him, I think, because mm-hmm. he switched the style up. The animal aggression would get him through certain things, you know. Yeah, where because yeah, yeah, yeah. I I see a, t- a thing. I don't know where it was. No, no one said this. Thing. I saw a thing where he went to one boxing place that he used to go to when he was younger, and he bucked a couple of the men that are still there, and they were doing something. I can't remember what. And he jokes with him and he goes, "I'm actually a shit boxer," you know. Yeah. Like now, when he said that, he ain't a shit boxer, 
Yeah. But I know he he ain't some he did, he weren't boxing from these men have been boxing from five years old. Usyk yeah, yeah. and these men they're boxing boxing, and it's a big difference between that and a man that started boxing. How old? Eighteen? Yeah. Nineteen? You see what? So he's yeah. playing catch up and he's been thrown in the deep end. So between these men that have got this mad natural talent, they move perfect. They step mm-hmm. around. Remember Usyk's coach is Lemachenko's dad. You know. Yeah. You know Lemachenko, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. So like it's levels like yeah. these men. The man's had 300 amateur fights. Do you know the ring experience that is? You see what I'm trying to say? Yeah, 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 yeah. Like, it's a different kind of animal. So if you ain't bringing that uh, aggression to just, mm-hmm. to counter, to catch, to close the gap with aggression, yeah. you're going to have a long, you're going to have a oh, long man. neck. Yeah. And when you're the heavyweight champion of the world, you've got to fight who's coming. So you're going to get killers. Mm-hmm. But then with that said, anyone's going to be a hard fight right yeah. now if um, if he's if he's just on the boxing, boxing thing. Because mm-hmm. who wins if AJ fights Dillian White right now? See, the man them's pulled. If no one said, yeah, AJ wins straight away. Because Dylan, where Dylan... Because Dylan's an animal, blood. Animal. Heart gets him through everything. He's like, that brother, he ain't in it. If he sees he's losing, he's just going to take it to some animal shit, innit? Yeah, and let's yeah, just swing yeah. out. We're yeah. going to swing out, innit? Yeah. We're going to swing out. And someone's getting licked down in there yeah. today. And I know what you mean. It's like AJ's lost that. Like, he's lost and that animal where even in the Dylan White fight, it was it was like the battle anim- of the animal. That was an animal like, team. Yeah, it was like, an animal that team. Was, that was King Kong Godzilla team. Yeah, like, yeah, that yeah, was proper yeah, animal yeah, yeah, yeah. Man, they were swinging out at the end swinging of the round. Out. That was some proper, oh. yeah. That is swinging out. And I think, I feel like AJ, I don't feel like he needs to prove to the world he's a boxer. He like, don't. He don't, like, because... But you got to listen to your coach. you got to listen to That's your coach. It's the coach's fault. Yeah, it's the coach's fault. But I feel like... If it ain't broke, don't fix it. You ain't got to prove to everyone you're a boxer because you're a heavyweight champion of the world. You got all the like all the belts apart from the WBO, See. You get WBC belt. You got all the belts apart from the WBC. You fought bare man, and he's fought like the best in the heavyweights that are out there. So it's not like, uh, but I feel like also I feel like because like the cult. This is and this is today's culture. No matter how well and how successful my man gets, they will always make him feel like he's not good enough. And that's the thing. So it's like you're always trying to prove a point. So it's like everyone ain't just loving AJ and just showing him mad. Because he he's got a lot of haters. As well as he's got a lot of fans that like him, he's got a lot of man that, well, he ain't fought no one. Or even with him yeah, fighting all these men, oh, Fury's still better. But Fury, oh, he really, who did really Fury fight? Unless my man and he's fought Wilder. Like, do you get what I'm saying? When he fought, was it, um, when you won the belts? I think Fury's better though. I've yeah, no, no, as a boxer, time. but you what I'm saying, well, as a boxer, uh, yeah, as a boxer, I know he's better. But what I'm saying is, in terms of who he's fought, no, AJ's like, got the AJ's, got AJ's the CV better. is mad better. AJ's, but then, AJ's, yeah, Fury is the better boxer. Better. But it's like people will still respect Fury's CV and what he's done over all this what AJ's done for the culture. And I feel that sometimes, if to do all of that, it would be annoying. Like to the point where you want like your your whole setup is to be like, you know, what? I want people to say I'm a good boxer. 100. Like on top of me being the heavyweight champ. Yeah, that could be part of the. You process. get what I'm saying? It could be part of the process. No, I, you get me? Like, could be part of it because that's why I in the room. That's why I try to champion AJ in the room mm-hmm. because. I look at it and just think, fam, it's a brother that's just been kind of thrown in. It's like taking you at 18 and saying, all right, Doug, you look like you're going to go jail, this, that, the other. Mm-hmm. Come be a boxer. Da, 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 da. And you throw yourself all in. And you do so you've got to back that. got to back that. Because it's just one of the man because that's doing a boxer. And that's why I've always loved AJ because obviously I told the story about seeing man at Jalouse, but it's like from that, I was that, that was always one man over. But it's like, you come from the roads, come from where man has come from. Bruv, heavyweight champion of the world. Put the, the, the heavyweight scene back on the map because it was dead. Like none of these men were getting big payday fights. None of them could sell out O2. And I'm not talking about the politics of it. I'm not talking about whether he tells man take vaccine, don't. No, yeah. I see people talking about that. I don't know about all of that. Like yeah. all that side of it, I'm talking about boxing, boxing, man's boxing, the culture, and this, that, the other, and it, and what he's doing. Yeah. Like as far as it, Bam. bringing man them true, coming out to man them. It was gigs he come out to last yeah. fight, doing what he's doing, all of that kind of stuff. So I got to back it in it. Got to, man. I got to push, push behind. No homo. I gotta work. <laughs> I gotta be behind Holmes, no homo again, <laughs> and fucking just make sure that we're supporting. You get me? No, but it's real, and I don't understand why this culture can't get like can't support people and get behind things like this because it's like like. It's like, we've all like, said, man, certain man, I, I see it in my WhatsApp group, certain man will just hate man for the sake of, oh, well, he's shit. What do you mean? Like, bro, that's not really, like, do you, do you know, like, you got, champion we, of the world, bro. champion of the world, like, and this is the thing, people struggle to support people when they're winning, like, I don't get it, like, no, you know, it's like, you know, like, we, st- we was asked the question, like, do you, if someone was doing well or whatever, do you support it? And regardless of what man's opinion of someone, if they're doing well and you can take those attributes, like man said, the where he's come from, everything, Man get like man's fully supporting that like and happy for man. Do you get I don't what think I'm saying? There was that much hate this time though. What's that uh, with this one? Yeah, it weren't as bad. Or it weren't as bad, but could you say he lost? Not. 
masses. From the masses, when he lost, I, man, when I was in Leeds, man was like, good, like, he's fucking, he's good. Right. See, this is, this is cool him out. Like, no, Bear Man was Where happy for him to have lost. Then, huh? Where you? I was in Leeds. Like, a lot of man was happy for him to have lost. Then, I was upset though. I was fully, like, upset about I, it. I'll be real. I was like, because I can't, I'll be real, I kind of expected it. Mm-hmm. Like I said to man, I kind of expect. I said to the man in the morning, like, boy, listen, mm-hmm. I kind of expected, but I watched it with my little son. And last time he stayed up on a thing like this was it was um World Cup. <laughs> so he's sitting next to me and he's like, he's cussing. Yeah. And, oh, go to the body. I'm thinking, right. <laughs> like, why, why are you going to his body? Because yeah. like, he's moving his head, go to his body. And then by the time, time it was done, he, he's like, I'm going to my bed. Every time I stay out to support someone from England, this yeah, is yeah, yeah, yeah. I said to him, listen, don't fall sorry for AJ, son. He's a millionaire. He's all right. Don't worry. Yeah. He's done well in his life. He's won many fights, made a load of money. You yeah. understand? But they was upset. That's what I mean. Like, it goes... The, you So look into my yeah, man. Yeah, you understand? Yeah, so yeah, yeah. you can't totally bun him. You yeah, see what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, you lot yeah, bun yeah. him, but like, little youths are looking at he's him. Carrying, they he's could carrying be a, a lot on his back. You see what I'm saying? Yeah, he's carrying a lot. He's carrying a lot. A lot, a lot. So... But I feel like he go he goes and wins the second one, hundred percent. I'm gonna move on from the topic on that because that's Doug's word and Doug's word carries a lot of weight in the room. So yeah, shout out AJ. <laughs> yeah, get back to the rematch and let's mm-hmm. see what goes on from there. On to this weekend, Wilder versus Fury. Who's winning? Free Wilder versus Fury. Free Doug, go first. Go. <laughs> Who's winning, Doug? I like I would like Dante to win, but Fury is gonna Fury. I feel like. But I don't know. After Billy, you see, what I used to feel like all of them man there were unbeatable. That like that whole camp, and then after Billy Joe took that loss, I don't know if it's another one's due in the camp. Do you get what I'm saying? Billy Joe was never Billy Joe was never beating Canelo. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Like, I don't know, but it just depends. Like Wild, like this is the thing. Wilder's got the heart and he's got the fight, but he ain't got nowhere near the boxing skill in it. So, that's the issue. and that's the issue. So it just it just all depends. Like. They've not watched much of the build up to it, so I don't really know what's going on in terms of the build up where they're at in terms of who's in each other's head. But um, uh, I feel like Fury's got it, but I would like Dante to win it. But we'll see. Who's winning? Oh, you said you put a bet on yesterday, didn't it? I put a bet on nine I put on the odds. I don't know. I don't know yet. I Who you? You're, be- you're back in Wilder. Yeah. You think Wilder's winning? Yeah, because you never know. It's a one punch knockout, there, man. Yeah, he can always win. He's definitely got the. He's yeah, definitely. Yeah, got yeah, yeah. That that's what I'm saying. Bro, he connects. It's like um, if you watch like a trilogy like the Marquez and Pacquiao, yeah, like he might have thought our oh, Pacquiao. So let's take a moment. Just hold it, Rex. How are we feeling about Pacquiao's retirement? Say it with your chest, but I know it's emotional. Is your family like Andy? Needed. It was needed. It was needed. I was waiting for it. Yeah. <laughs> 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 I was waiting. Did you like have a little special meal or something in honor? <laughs> no, no. Like, no candlelight, no candles. Uh. <laughs> no, 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 no. Weren't that deep? Weren't that deep? No candles. He just moves on to the next era. He's the president yeah, yeah, yeah. next. Year. next mm-hmm. Go on, Pons, back to what you're I saying. I was saying the trilogy, Marquez and Pacquiao, like, ever thought Pacquiao was going to win that? And then out of the Marquez blue, just got knocked, knocked out. Fuck. Out, out spark, yeah. yeah. So, knocked. you know what I mean? Like, I feel like Wilder could pull it out of the bag, man. Mm-hmm. Like, regardless if he got a new chain or old chain or what. Wait, if Fury slips, one slips, get one caught slipping. But I also think the way Fury won the last one could lead you into a full sense of security because you fully dominated, man. Fully. Look so at- you could come into that thinking he's he's a yeah. that, he's a bum dosser, like he likes to say, and go into it and mm. he's sleeping. Keys, Remember the old keys? Mm. Wilder lost the first one, but obviously was it was it a draw yeah. in it? Yeah. yeah. Ortiz. Yeah, when he fought the bread, yeah, when he fought the bread with the dress. Both times, yeah, but remember, it looked like it was close. He was losing till he knocked him out. Yeah, the second time, just come back and knocked him out. I said, yeah, look, I've done the job now. So he might do that to Fury, like. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, y
if he gets backed up again, I don't think he can fight going backwards. No. I think that's the problem. He needs to be leading the dance. Yeah, When yeah. he gets moved back, tell me if I'm chatting shit, Palm, you're the boxing guy. When he's getting moved backwards, mm -hmm. he don't fight so well. Yeah. On the back On the back foot, yeah. So I think if Fury comes for him, walks him down, walks him down, it may be a better fight, it may be a more competitive fight, mm -hmm. but I think if Fury keeps coming for him, coming for him, I think Fury wins again. It's not a better fight. Say again? It's not a better fight. It won't be a better fight. No, what are you saying? He's coming for a paycheck, last one. I reckon I'm Fury wins. Mm. Yeah, you, listen, that's what you always have to remember with these fights, you know. These men are getting paid millions of... So they're going to talk a good one. They're going to talk you up. What? David Hay didn't draw a man out and full man with Tony Bell. You re See, look at man that kissed their teeth straight away. He, David Hay talked the best one. Knew took he the best even stand one. The second up. fight was the worst. Knew that he couldn't even stand up. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, bro. You see what I'm trying to say? But uh, man will sell the fight. But I don't even know how man lose his foot like that. Like in box. Oh, bro. He knew he needed to. <laughs> he knew. He as knew, man, as but, man's fighting in his but man ankle forgot goal, the bro. business man. <laughs> man forgot the businessman and the hustler that, that David Hay is, bro. Yeah, yeah. But he's like, boy, worst of all, I know my knee's not too stable, but I'm going to collect a, I don't know, a mill. Yeah. Stand, so it is what it yeah. is. Yeah. I, I hear what you're saying, Daps. He might just be coming for a, what are you saying, about, a payday. I'm at, no, Wilder, I'm talking about. What are you saying? He's he coming. Was he wasn't even in the, in the question. Like, all of a sudden, I'm back. But what are you saying, though? Not that pride, though. That pride, because he talks a lot of pride. Yeah, it must have been pride, because they, they, what, you reckon he just slept on it? Because, no, I feel like... He's he, training hard. Because, you know, but you remember, he's never took a loss like that. So, to take a loss like that, and in such embarrassing way, you remember, he come in the Terminator suit, he come like, fucking... Or Majid off like to come like that and then take that kind of loss, you need to take time. Like, it, like you know what I mean? Whereas AJ took that loss and just said instantly on the chair that he was going to take the rematch in the ring with, with man when he was standing there. Whereas Wilder maybe needed to take so some who, soul searching. Who, who would you believe in more? The one that says it straight away they won it or the one that needed to soul search? Both. Because why? Because AJ knew he shouldn't have lost that one. So that's why instantly he's like, fuck that, let's, re let's go again. And Wilder, because he never took that L before, and like in the way that he took it, maybe he needed to take some time out to realise you're not like that like guy that you always took yourself up to be. Mm. And like you maybe need to look inside yourself a little piece and go and come and back understand again. Understand that you're fighting a different kind the, of... Yeah, 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 yeah. guy that you think rolled off the sofa. And I remember, even when he rolled off the sofa, I said, like, I think Fury wins, the first one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah, he's going to have to... These men are going to have to... We're gonna see. We're mm -hmm. gonna see. We're gonna see. Yeah. I agree with what you're saying. The one punch knockouts there. Everyone knows that. Yeah. But I just think that Fury's gonna just do the same again. Yeah. But yeah, it's just gonna him up. again. He's gonna yeah walk him down, and and I think Fury will be better. I think Man will be surprised because yeah. he's he's improving constantly. And he's and he's shedding weight and he's and getting he trim. He ain't yeah he ain't. Man was sick. He said reschedule. Yeah. Do it again. Yeah. He ain't taking no checks. No shortcuts. Mm -hmm. No half measures. Mm -hmm. So. And Wilder's needing that. Oh, he had flipping his glove, hand out his glove. My yeah. Remember, the man said everything from hand out a glove to my trainer. One of my one of my trainers Sparks poisoned me. Oh, yeah. You know that he said that one of his own trainers sparked sparked his water. Yeah, <clears throat> and he sacked the other trainer that, that threw the towel in. Oh, so, did he? Yeah. So yeah, the man. That, yeah, you got no excuses now. There's none. Yeah, so he's got to be victorious now. He's yeah. got to be standing with his hands raised at the end of that and the belt around his around his waist. Brother, what are we saying? You can have the final word on this. Who's yeah, winning? Fury, short and sweet, bro. Fury. Man said Fury, short and sweet. But I want Wilder to represent still. You know of course. What I'm saying him and if he does lose, him and AJ should fight. I don't know what else is going on. Nothing else to it but that. Last thing I want to speak before we exit. That's what I'm saying. Who's be, is anyone watching Raising Kane and, and the whole power thing? Anyone watching? No one. I watched the piece on that. I, I ain't deep into I don't want to talk too much. Man, they might as well. at the minute. Man said line of duty. Mm. I hear that. Right. Man then watch some <laughs> give that give strong, that a, strong, strong, strong. the whole power thing. <laughs> it's strong. Yeah, yeah, right now, you know. I, I, I the man. I'm just telling man them get involved because we're fifties guy with all of these shows. The they're all kind of well, they're all combining. The man's making his own like see like this oh, right. see how there's the whole Marvel universe. Yeah, yeah. A man's creating a a, a yeah. universe yeah. of of his people, so man them just get in, get involved and all of Is that. It like that, yeah. Yeah, he's got so he's got shows spinning off shows, spinning off shows. Mm. Yeah, characters cross over. Characters from Both different. Scenes. Yeah, he's, he's creating his own thing going on. So, oh, but yeah, you need yeah, to start. Yeah. Have you watched Power? Yeah, yeah I watched Power. Right. Not all of it though, but I've watched Power. Right, you got to watch. You got to watch all of Power and then take it from there. I what watched up until Ghost's daughter got shot. 
Oh, you're way behind. You're early. You're early. You're early. Uh, you're watching Line of Duty. Watching, my man's watching Line of Duty with Arnold. Arnold and Hastings. Yeah, 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 yeah. Man's living a good life. Man's, man's living a good life. Line of Duty, I play. I don't know them way there. But I'm a box set man, so I've seen all of them, so I know exactly what you're Line of Duty can work, but you need to see power. You got, yeah, you got to get up on your power. You got a lot to watch there still. You got a lot, in it? What, what about Snowfall? You seen Snowfall? Nah. What? Fucking hell, mate. Doug's not a TV man. Nah, I'm on. <laughs> Doug's on road. I'm on road and football. Yeah, he's on the road. All right, no, no. Take your time. Do you finish up line of duty. Yeah. Hastings are not. What's the girl's name? What's her name again? That girl that no one likes. That Kate. bitch. Kate. That. Deep in it. Kate. Deep man, in it. Yeah. Kate. 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 Yeah, finish Kate. up line of duty. Yeah. A lot of the viewers will be like, yeah, I watch line of duty as well. Yeah, mm-hmm. cool. Season, whatever's coming back. What's that? I don't that? know about Squid Game. Is it like Battle Royale? Is it like Battle Everyone's Royale? Everyone's talking Squid Game thing. Everybody's talking Squid Game, so I'm trying to... Is that good? They're saying it's the best show. Well, numbers-wise, it's the best show to ever hit Netflix. Yeah. Squid Game, yeah? Yeah, numbers-wise. Nah, I've been trying to avoid it, but now it's been said in this room, I'm going to have to yeah, take I'm it I'm going to watch it, but I'm trying to film. Rex, you seen Squid Game? So why are you keeping quiet for, blood? Why are you keeping quiet for, blood? You, yeah, you're making a man. But for some reason, yeah, I knew Rex must have seen Squid Game. Yeah, no, yeah, yeah, I knew because Rex is that kind of, it's his era, isn't it? Yeah. So why not contribute to the conversation, blood? All man wants to do is just collect peace. No, no, nah, nah, he's working. I can see it. He's working. He's watching everything in the screen. Like he's... He ain't watching shit. <laughs> <laughs> He's thinking about where you're about to burn after this. Yeah, yeah, I got that Cali. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got that Cali bud. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's trying to get hot. All right, so yeah, we got to see Squid Game. Man, them check out Power, all the Kanan and all of that. Other mm-hmm. kind of Ghost Power Book 1 and all of that. They're decent still. I've watched it. Bro, Doug, you got to see Snowfall. Yeah. Well, yeah, you definitely got to watch Snowfall, Doug. That's, that's one. That, that's yeah, it's mad, yeah? Bad boy problem, show. Man. Okay, say no more. I had a feeling but, you hadn't seen it. That's why I said it. Yeah, Dampson, one of the man names. In yeah, it, you know, yeah, I'm he plays the lead in, still. I need to take that lead. in. So yeah, man. With that said, we're gonna wrap up another one. We kept it all current today. Let's yeah. End. Oh, shout out, Lex Stas, mm-hmm. Cognac. Yeah, we must mm-hmm. give them a shout out. Mm-hmm. Donny sent over a couple of bottles. Of shout out, Roof. Cognac. Yeah. What's his name again? R- Roof. Shout out, Roof. Sent mm-hmm. over a couple of bottles of this. So you lot check this out. Look it up. Get involved. The reason there's only one bottle, not two, is because I already knocked my one back on the weekend. <laughs> you know, I was partaking in some, you know, some good cognac and a cigar and all of that. You know, we yeah. got to do it up. So, yeah. But shout out them, man. Shout out Manscaped. We're going to shout them out now. Mm-hmm. Shout out Manscaped. You lot get involved. If you if you haven't already got one, use the code WINNERS. 20% discount plus free shipping. Mm-hmm. The lawnmower 4.0 is where it's at. Every man in the room's been using them, so I've been told, and it's had wonders for them. Rex said he's been using his one on a regular basis. It's done wonders. He said life's great. Life's great. He said his ratio of fellatio has increased by times 10. Mm. Those that don't know what that is, they can. He said times 10. Times 10. He said yeah. times 10. He said she can't get enough. Can't get enough. She can't get enough of him right now. He said, P, you changed the game. Changed the game. He said, since I shaved my chest and that, she's just looking at me like I'm a different man. <laughs> <laughs> that's why he said that he said yeah, I'm saying that's why you grew the moustache yeah he said yes yeah. he said yes I saw I needed some here somewhere Is so it? I've gone with the moustache I understand <laughs> Rex that's why man rocked the champion hat today Trust he was fully me. going for it I understand yeah it's champion like, it, that's why Champ- you're you champion been knocking it out the park this week that's what it is yeah and also you probably saw the advert earlier in the mix we're getting behind I'm getting behind the um a free service they're doing to encourage people to go to university. Mm-hmm. They work for free. It's called platinumservices.com mm-hmm. or .co.uk, whichever. But they work for free, helping you lot go uni. Look into it. Don't let them tell you because you didn't pass these courses that you can't go university. Trust you me. can contact these people and they'll help put you in the, in the right direction. It's a free movement. They're not earning. They're just grafting to try and help people forward and get better positions in life. So don't feel that your options are limited because you didn't pass your GCSEs, you didn't pass your A-levels. Contact this UK Platinum Services and see what can be done. Use the referral code POUND, P-O-U-N-D-S, and let's try and get more buds in uni. Let's mm-hmm. try and get more buds in further education and make things happen, yeah? Mm. But yeah, once again, it's been Pound Sterling, Big Doug, man, yeah. I'm in the room, Winners Podcast, another one, Current Affairs. Come Easy. on. Stat.